Magma is rising in Askia. Askia is a region in the central parts of the Iceland. It receives less rain than the rest of the country because it's in the rain shadow of the central range. And uh, the magma is gathering there since the, uh, 2010, we have noticed that. Uh, our seismogram shows a renewed activity. Magma is rising there all the time. The discontinuity you see there in the tremor chart, I believe that this is not due to the failure of the devices. Maybe NATO or Americans are doing tests, so they have to turn off the seismogram so you don't see those tremors, those explosions they are doing there. The weapons test, practically. What you see in the central of the regions of this area, in the summertime when it is accessible, in the wintertime it is a no-go area. So practically you cannot go there. It's a lot of uh, thick layers of lava formed over the, you know, 200 years and before that even we have found the uh, lapilli uh, pyroclastic deposits of the Askia as far as Romania and uh, even probably Anatolia and uh, that's the reason this volcano is important if it erupts it will create a lot of chaos in the aviation in those areas so that is the reason we keep monitoring this area uh, as you can see in, the ch in these charts one of these craters numerous creatures exist there, shows the sign of actually magma rising. It's not an imminent threat of the eruption, but the magma is rising there continuously. It needs more mass, more pressure, gases, volatiles, to actually create a subplenian uh, eruption in that region. And that can actually be something violent that we have to worry about. Askia compared to other volcanoes, as you can see here, is uh, is uh, going to create a huge ash cloud which rises to the stratosphere if if it uh, faces the right conditions so there is something to look at here for the future